thank you for your interest in Stark State College's practical nursing program. My name is Barb Dawson. I am the program coordinator for the practical nursing program. My office is located on the Akron Perkins campus. I would like to start with giving you some information about licensed practical nurses. <clears throat> LPNs work under the direction of a registered nurse or physician performing duties such as basic nursing care, monitoring patient status, administering medications, initiating and maintaining IV fluids, wound care, and communicating with the health care team. LPNs must attend a nursing school approved by the Ohio Board of Nursing. They must complete a National Council licensure examination for practical nursing and on satisfactory passing of the NCLEX exam will receive an Ohio licensure <clears throat> that includes medication and IV certification. This Ohio licensure can transfer to any other state if a nurse moves or wishes to work in more than one state. Our practical nursing program has a full five-year approval by the Ohio Board of Nursing. Our instructors are all registered nurses, most with many years of experience in practical nursing education. Our NCLEX pass rates are consistently well above the national average, and our long-term relationships <clears throat> with healthcare facilities in our area allow our graduates to have 100% job placement. Most of our graduates are hired by our clinical sites where they've completed their clinical experiences throughout school. Many have chosen a job well before they graduate. Job opportunities <clears throat> are in long-term care facilities, hospitals, urgent care centers, doctor's offices, schools, correctional facilities, home care, rehab units, and many other areas. Wages for new graduates are between $18 and $24 an hour with a median salary of $43,430. Our graduates also are able to get jobs that offer benefits such as healthcare benefits, tuition assistance, or tuition reimbursement if they prefer to go on to, RN pro to an RN program. If you are interested in the courses that are part of the, the practical nursing program, please tap on the courses tab on the top of our web page. The day program can be completed in two semesters for a total of 36 credit hours. A new cohort begins each fall semester and each spring semester to allow applicants a quicker starting time. The Day program hours are Monday through Friday within the hours of 7.30 a.m. and 4.30 p.m. Classroom and practice lab is completed at the Akron campus and clinical experiences are completed at healthcare facilities within a 75 mile radius of the school. The evening weekend program can be completed in four semesters for a total of 36 credit hours. No, new cohorts begin each spring semester. Class and practice labs are one to two evenings a week from 4 to 9.30 p.m. and clinical experiences on Saturdays from 8 to 2.30. Again, classroom and practice labs are completed at the Akron campus and clinical experiences are completed at area healthcare facilities. The projected cost sheet for the practical nursing program is included on the PN website under the practical nursing admission application checklist. The total cost of the program is just over $9,000. This um, cost does include fees that um, may need to be paid out of pocket such as um, ID badges, um, graduation expenses, and um, licensure requirements after graduation. So please speak to a financial aid advisor in the Gateway Center to discuss um, the costs of the program and what can be included in your tuition and fees or your funding. 
So if you're interested in getting started on your LPN education, you may begin by applying for admission to Stark State College. Gateway specialists are available to help you with these six easy steps. Once you have become a student at Stark State College, you may begin the practical nursing admission requirements. Applicants must have a 2.0 or better on either a high school transcript or a post-secondary transcript. <clears throat> they must have math and reading proficiency. Your admission advisor may be able to help you to determine your proficiency in those areas by looking at your Accuplacer scores or your post-secondary transcripts. The Practical Nursing Admission application <clears throat> can be found on our website on the left-hand column under Practical Nursing Application. A background check is required. Guidelines for the background check is also located in the left column of our web page. For admission into the Practical Nursing Program, applicants must complete the TEAS test and receive a overall score of a 58.7 or better. If you would like more information on how to prepare for the TEAS test, please see the website listed here as there are um, different tools for preparing you to take the TEAS test prior to your scheduled time. The TEAS test may be taken on campus or remotely. If you want to get more information on when the test is available on campus or how to schedule um, a remote TEAS test, please see the details in our PN admission application checklist that's found on our PN website in the left-hand column. Another practical nursing admission requirement is the Anatomy and Physiology Bio 101 and Student Success Seminar SSC 101. <clears throat> These are considered prereqs or co-reqs, which means that they can be taken prior to beginning the PN courses or they can be taken, taken during the first semester of the practical nursing program. We do strongly encourage you to take these courses prior to the beginning of the PN courses as our program is full time. If you are currently enrolled or taking these courses during the summer session, please mark in progress on your application. If you choose to take these courses in conjunction with the PN courses, you must complete the courses during the first semester of the PN program. Again, if you choose to take these courses in conjunction with the PN courses, you must complete both courses during the first semester of the PN program, requiring you to take 19 credit hours the first semester. In order to apply for the practical nursing program, applicants must submit the following three documents. The PN application, which can be found on the um, PN website, the background check email that is received from security after they have received your official report from a background check, and your official TEAS scores. These three documents must be submitted together and taken to the Akron Gateway Center, attention Barb Dawson. The deadline for all of our spring, our fall cohorts is May 15th and the deadline for spring cohorts is November 15th. Once the applications have been submitted, the admission committee will review the applications and make decisions on admission into the program. A maximum of 46 students will be chosen for each cohort. The admission committee will notify the applicants of admission or denial by email within two weeks following the deadline. All letters of or all emails for admission or denial will be sent to the student Stark State College email address. So it is important that students have their Stark State College email address up and running and be watching for those emails. 
the students that have received acceptance emails will be instructed on further requirements to be completed prior to the start of classes. There will also be an orientation audio PowerPoint that the students are required to view. So let us know how we can help you. For questions about admissions to Stark State College or your math or reading eligibility, please contact a Gateway Specialist. Danielle and Nick are available at these phone numbers and email addresses. If your questions are about the PN application or the PN course information, please feel free to email me or call and leave a voicemail. Thank you and I hope to talk to you soon.